Hello, everyone. I'm Young Do Gon, Senior Director at Emco Technology. Also, I'm Team Development Program Manager. And today, I will present you some information on high performance team for DDD Fleet BGA product. The agenda today, section one, I will introduce the semiconductor device and package trend. On section two, I will focus on team on why team is uh, important. On section three, I will summarize the finding of what I will present to you today. This slide showed you semiconductor device research from Northeastern University showing GPU and GPU transistor density trend. You can see both the CPU, GPU transistor count by year on the bottom graphs. Also, we can recognize both low is valid as their transistor density continues to increase annually. The other one is uh, the base clock speed and die size. They are, they are also increasing steadily as well. Also power density is another trend of semiconductor devices that must be considered. Junction temperature is important to operate semiconductor device reliably. The power trend is outpacing the power requirement. Especially logic state power trend is increased dramatically. So the appeared the concern is to be what how to keep a junction temperature for reliable customer, uh, reliable semiconductor device operation. Let's move to Fleet BJ product trend. As we have seen, the semiconductor technology node is decreasing continuously. In the case of single die Fleet BJ, the recent die size are larger than 650 millimeter square. The other development of 2.5D module, which is composed, on, composed of the SOC and several HPM memory dies. The module size is increasing as well because more memory is required. A short interconnection among semiconductor devices is necessary to provide a better electric performance. And the die quantity of advanced system in package for Fleetsy BJ product is increased. All this trend, we may be concerned about increasing package summer stress. The advanced bridge BJ packaging is needed needs the heterogeneous integration technology. To reduce package body size with a, a dense die interconnection. This is the key for near future business of the advanced system in package for Bleach BJ product. Heterogeneous integration technology has have two different paths of a, a fine interconnection base, semi uh, substrate and RDL interposure. This results in two challenges, how to make uh, an efficient summer dissipation for reliable product operation. Second one is how to apply 
the proper package reliability conditions for qualifying heterogeneous integrated packages. This slide shows a good case study of summer simulation with the die layout on the module. There is two cases. In case one, 250 watt full supply are located at the package center. In case two, each CPU is placed at the package corners. You can easily see which one is better in terms of summer dissipation. Based on this result, I can tell the spacing between high power CPUs can significantly impact temperatures. However, realistically, high power CPUs should still not be placed to near package concert. corners, package corners. This is the issue, how to keep the junction temperature needed for reliable product operation. So I will focus on Timon on the next slide. On this section, I will focus on why Tim is important. There are two main trends on summer packaging, SETA SA, less than 0 0.05 degrees C per watt. Die power densities higher than 0.5 watt per millimeter square. Based on these two trends, the cooling system is being ch changed to high performance cooling system. SETA JC is a very critical and significant to a factor in high performance systems. Also, T1 is an important portion of SETA JC. So on the next slide, I will focus on T1. Team summer conductivity value is measured and provided by team suppliers. In the table on the left, there's some information for each team summer conductivity values. The higher summer conductivity team started A, B, C, D, E, F as an order. In addition, summer conductivity is not measured on the same metrology for all suppliers. So, setization measurement is the solution to know the real team summer performance in the package. On the, this slide, I would like to explain summer team summer performance is not derived from team summer conductivity. In the table on the left, there is a set of JC A value for each. The first column is a team model and assembly process number. Second column is a set of JC A values for each with measuring 60 body summer test vehicle of the leaded fridge BJ with the 25.6 uh, 25 uh, millimeter square die. You can see this is summer set of JC A value is not matched for each team summer conductivity value. For example, model C summer conductivity is uh, lower than model B, but in the case of SETA JC A value, model C is uh, lower than model B. This is uh, really not matched for summer conductivity. The other example, very interesting one, the model F. On the same model with a different the process, we can see the different the SETA JCA value. 
Model D slash 3 has a 17.5. Model F slash 3 is 3.4.8 Zeta GHA value. I will explain more details about that. Next slide. First of all, I would like to explain about the equation of the T1 summer lessons. First of all, that equation on the left, the K value, summer conductivity, and die area is uh, fixed in the designed package. Only BRT thickness and contact resistance value is variable, variable in the different read attach. The result is uh, in the table on the right. The top is a model app with the assembly number two. Bottom is model app with the process number three. You can see the different SAT image top and bottom with different process. Also, we detected the different BLT. Process number two provides thinner BLT than process number three. Also, this different BLT matched for SETA JCA measured value. Team model D is a higher summer conductivity team, 4.7 watt per meter K in the aluminum pillar base polymer team. In the table, you can see three different SAT images. Also, you can recognize that each image has a different team die coverage. Also, you can see each different BLT. This means in the case of a model D, need the enough BLT thickness to make a good team die coverage. This means uh, even the high summer conductivity team cannot make uh, a good lower Zeta JC team, sub, team uh, summer performance in the package. So all this the summer performance dependent on this assembly quality. Under this section, I will explain how to select it correctly the team matched for customer requirement. Many suppliers introduce new teams. So MCO uses a new team screen flow. This slide shows the flow step by step. The most important step is the, to confirm the team summer, summer performance by measuring Zeta JC after confirming assembly quality. As pre previously explained that assembly quality is critical to confirm new team because team on BLT thickness and interfacial contact resistance value are dependent on assembly quality. Uh, again, SETA JC measurement is needed to know the real summer performance of team in the package form. Also, SETA JC measurement in a well-controlled lab are essential. As a result, we can quickly and correctly select the best team for customer product qualification using our summer test capability. In closing, I would like to summary what I presented to you today. For semiconductor device and package trend, the transistor and power densities are still increasing yearly. The decreasing node size continues and requires lower junction temperatures for reliable operation. So to keep a lower set of JC is important. Timon is an important factor for reducing SETA JC as well. Team summer conductivity is an indicator only of expected team one summer performance of package because team summer performance 
relies on assembly quality. MCO has the capability to provide actual thermal performance using thermal test die and realistic package assembly. Anco continually accesses the market for the best teams available and skilled assembly know-how to complement to them. Thank you for your time and attention.